This is Antonio Wells of AndroidTap.com, the world's leader in Android app reviews. Find the best Android app recommendations on AndroidTap.com. Today we're taking a look at World War. It's a fantasy role play style game where you play against uh, other players online and you take missions from the president and try to accomplish these goals and you can attack other players, you can gain money, you can build defenses, all in a effort to have some good time wasting fun. And right off I want to show you about that daily bonus because this is the type of game, it's not a play and throw away. You can play it across several days and, and build your army so today every day you log in there's a new uh, monetary bonus that you can stack up just by logging in it tracks all of that stuff so we'll go ahead and take that 16 grand and add it to what we already have the best way to learn this game is to poke around every different feature but we'll, we'll show you all that but first I want to show you the alliance accept acceptances and Basically, you share your code. There's, a, there's my code. And you can check out people who want to accept you. And when you do so, you're a part of their army. So we'll go ahead and accept everybody and take a look at who we have in our alliance. So right now it's at 34, but you can take a look at who's in your alliance, what country they're from, what level they've made it to, and, and check out their rank, write a message, and things like that. We're going to go back to the home screen and <clears throat> excuse me, take a look at the missions. Uh, these are things that you can do uh, to gain more experience. They, they take away energy and ammo to do so, but they, they give you more monetary uh, money to stack up in your vault and things like that. Units are the various things that you can buy, like the uh, weapons and uh, the uh, vehicles buildings, defense towers. Battle is where you can battle other users around the world. Uh, I would strongly suggest that you take some of that money and, and get a strong defense and offense before you battle someone because uh, once you start losing a lot, then that, it, it is hard to get those wins back, but it's possible. Just complete some, mission and, complete some missions and buy some things and that's doable. So the first thing we're gonna look at is the missions. And we'll go ahead and do one since everything is loaded. The health is high, energy is high, my ammo is high. We're on level seven. As soon as this loads up, so <clears throat> you do everything from uh, defend off the enemy attack all the way up to something as high as invade enemy, enemy ter territory. So we're gonna go ahead and I'll just do that since I already had about 70% of it complete. From that, I will gain about between 23 and 42 thousand dollars. 10 experience points, a chance at getting some loot, but it's going to cost me 98 experience out of the 200 that I have. It's going to take three trucks, uh, three boats, and one helicopter, which I should already have purchased. If not, it'll alert me to purchase what I don't have. So we'll go ahead and do it. And since I've already done about 70% of it, that put me at 100, so that particular mission is mastered. And you can see from that, I gained. $35,000, 10 experience points, I used up 98 energy, but since I completed that mission, it replenished my energy, so I can go ahead and do some of the other, uh, let's go ahead with some of these smaller tasks. And oftentimes it takes anywhere from three to five times of doing the same mission to complete that particular mission. Master the smaller one. Let's let's move up to a larger one. Let's do one that takes 78. And let's do it. Actually, let's switch over. Let's go in and attack or battle one of the other players. And what it does, it matches you up against comparable other players at about the same level and uh, army size that you have. And you can go ahead and just attack them. World War, my record has been pretty good as far as attacking others. You can see I won that battle. I took uh, 12 damages, but I 
from the guy. I didn't gain any money. He probably didn't have any, but I got three experience points for doing so. And you can see all our various units that were used in doing that attack. So we've just attacked and won. We'll move over to units to show you what lives there. And this is where you can purchase things like your military personnel. Like for now, I have five machine gunners. I have three in the fire team. I have four Marines. I don't have any paratroopers. So let's go ahead and deploy it, meaning to buy them. Let's buy a couple more. Three is good. And then let's see, I don't have any medics. That's always good to have those. So to about three medics and you can see some of the prisoners that I've taken and let's move over to the ground see what I have there I have a couple trucks a couple Humvees a couple light tanks and I don't have any military mobile artillery so let's go ahead and buy one of those move over to water I have a couple cruisers a couple transports and see, I don't have a naval tanker, so let's go ahead and buy one of those and move over to air. A couple fighter planes, a cargo chopper. I don't have a patrol plane or a Harrier jet. I really do like how that jet looks. I have over $100, so let's go ahead and buy one of those. And even a patrol plane, just to have one in case I need it. then move over to buildings. Buildings are what can bring in income. As you can see, I have uh, 73.25 every 50 minutes that I'll earn. The more that I buy, the more that it will bring in. Or sometimes if you buy, let's say, a barracks, every five minutes it adds an energy point. And a defense tower, it adds 10 defense towers. So you can see the monetary values and what it brings in. My next goal, I wanna buy a weapons factory. And you can see it brings in 16.5 every 50 minutes that'll tack on to the 7300 that I'm already bringing in. So this game, in a nutshell, it's a, it's a, it's a fantasy role play style game. Uh, you can see uh, what's going on in your history of the game. You can go see the president. And I, have in, I don't have any honor points, but if I did have some, I can replenish um, some of the energy if I happen to get low or other things, or even log on online to check out some things. It's a good game to play from, from day to day or even from hour to hour to keep you know good time where it's the fun. So I highly recommend that you check this game out.